This video demonstrates removal of the Orinco Advantex AX20 splitter valve flow diversion system for purposes of cleaning and inspection. The valve shown here is used in Mode 3 systems where nitrogen removal is a priority. The procedures for removing the Mode 1 splitter are basically the same, but it will be located in the riser over the recirculating blend chamber next to the pump vault. Extreme caution must be used when removing and replacing the Mode 1 splitter valve because it is very easy to damage when doing so. Please subscribe to our channel and find us on www.rcworst.com. Thank you. All right, so we're going to pull this is a Mode 3 Advantex system, AX20 unit. We're going to pull the recirculating splitter valve, which is a duck bill. My helper here is going to make that out, pull that all the way out. And then you can kind of see down there where that slides into. And you can see the, the cage is a little dirty, so we're going to spray that off. Um, in extreme cases, we like to pull that cage apart, but usually that's not necessary. Um, then we want to spray this out. You got to be a little careful because sometimes you have uh, these gaskets you got to reinsert into the groove. You don't want that to break. Although that isn't probably the end of the world if it doesn't seal perfectly. But it is a good idea to make sure that's set up right. And then once we're done with that, we're going to test the scum and sludge down there. We'll do that next. So to seat this back in there, Cass is going to demonstrate. You just turn it and align it and slide it right in the groove and voila perfect so that's also where we're going to sample so a lot of times what we do for sampling one of these systems is we pull the pull the splitter valve and then wait for the system to dose that's not always necessary but it's a good idea because right now we don't have much of a stream coming out of that but when it doses you let the initial influx come through and then you take it as the dose or as the flow starts to diminish down to a lower flow.